ndikulandire ni ku program ya badera imene pano pa Zodiac TV zina langa ndine Robert Kalua lero tili ku nchinji uko kumene kuti tuku ulisoka estate kumene kuti nabwera chifukwa kulinkani yojiritsa chidi kwambiri imene kudzwa kuti amala kwambiri tikoza kufuna kuti timve kuti kodi nsungwi zimagwira nchito yotani imene ito ndi tundi farm ndi yaikulu kwa basi e, 200 hectares imene ndi tu muma dzalidwa nsungwi zoka zoka komaso nsungwi zake sizimeti madziwa ino ndine zijaya izi ni nsungwi zimene ndi tu mutati mwaona muno bwino uh, nsungwi zake ndizo vomerezeka kuti izikhoza kudzalidwa komaso kumapangira zinthu zosiana siana pali zina nsungwi zimene amati huza kuti izimathaku uyaka azimatere ai sizimatere koma nsungwi zimene tu uzaona kuno amatha kupangira ndi tu zimatheka kupangira makala muno bwino makala opikira oti sa makala nthawe ya itali komaso ndi nsungwi zokuti mukoza kugwitsa nchito kupangira zinthu za mbiri zimene munganganize kuti mupangire ndemo nga mune tudziwira kuti dziko lino ndi tu mautenga oti anthu asamadule mitengo akhala kubwera ochuluka kwa basi koma mwina yena ndi tuzu kumapita kuti kodi anthu kuti kufunika kuti tsamadule miti mitengo i ndi kuotani ndiye kunoko tabwela kusamva nkhani Iyo sangala tsa kwambiri imene ndi tu inga pangitse kuti mwina amala wa mbiri asiye kudula uh, mitengo makisa wawa koma kumagwitsa nchito nsungwi zimene zabwera zimeta bwera uh, kuzaona kuno ku Lisoka estate mkati mu tikala tu kumana ndi nduna iyo na zachilengedwe komanso kusintha kwa nyengo olimekezeka a Michael usino wake dzino wake ndi Grant Blamrick amene akhala kuti tenga kutongosoya za mbiri zamene amadzalira nsungwi zi komanso nchito zimene amagwiritsa When and how did you conceive this idea? So I came to Malawi 20 years ago to work for the tobacco industry, cutting down trees in Chikingawa. Mm -hmm. So in Chikingawa. In Chikingawa. So that was all for fluke tobacco in the Kusungu area mm -hmm. for general farming. So we had a big job. We had to deliver approximately 150,000 cubic meters of firewood to 67 different estates across Kusungu and northern Malawi. So after doing that for two years, I could see that there wasn't enough reforestation being done. So I resigned from them. I opened my own business and uh, we two years, we could still see that there were no trees being replanted. So we started looking at different alternatives. Mm -hmm. Eucalyptus, imported pine from Sapi Mondi in South Africa. But the bottom line is everything, everything takes too long to grow. So we learned about this giant tropical bamboo, especially from Indonesia. Yeah. And um, we then, through our research, discovered that this giant bamboo only flowers every century, every 100, 120 years. So how is it possible to replant bamboo if there's no seed? So our research led us to some laboratories in Indonesia and Belgium that have developed a protocol to 
multiply this bamboo in a laboratory environment. So they are clones, all right? So that is now referred to as tissue culture. So what that means is uh, they grow this bamboo in an ideal environment in a laboratory and it is then able to, um, they are able to split it every four weeks. So one plant turns into two every four weeks, then two into four, four into eight, and so on and so forth. So that to us was the only way forward for us to be able to establish large scale plantations, to reforest Malawi. Mm -hmm. So that now is approximately 12 years ago. So we thought, okay, in order for us to do this, we need to start a nursery. So we started a nursery and we imported uh, every plant, every seedling came from Indonesia in an aeroplane. And um, we then established a nursery, we started looking for land. We were very fortunate to find this piece of land from mm -hmm. uh, Press Agriculture and we okay. were lucky enough to buy it. And then we thought, what better example than to grow what we are selling. Yes. So this is now what you see. We have 200 hectares of Dendrocalmus asper from Indonesia. 200 hectares? 200 hectares. Do you apply any fertilizers? It would not be fair if I applied fertilizers and advertised it that it doesn't need fertilizers. So all we do is we apply manure. Manure and compost. Ah. Gee, this is amazing. I'm very glad you're impressed. Yeah, I'm impressed. I don't see anybody that cannot be impressed. This is it, impressive. Very good. This is impressive. But now, say a local farmer wants to get into this business, yeah. but doesn't have this irrigation facility. Yes. How can you manage? So what I've suggested to multiple NGOs that have uh, tried to do what we are doing and replicate mm. and take this to a village environment where a household, they said to me, how many people, how many seedlings does a household need to be able to come to become fuel self-sufficient? Mm. So our calculations and our answer to that is 10 to 12 seedlings. Okay. For a household to become fully self-sufficient from three years onwards. And this will then last for the next 80 to 100 years. Sure. They'll never need to go and forage for firewood again. So how can you recover? We can recover. We can recover. That's the only way we're going to be able to allow our indigenous forests mm -hmm. to come back, is if we provide an alternative. Yes, of course, because the people need... They need an alternative, absolutely. To, to, to cook, they need to have the choice. Saves and, and all that. Exactly. They need the choice of firewood or charcoal. I've heard about this in Qatar. We're discussing about this, which, but I, I, I mean, I didn't know that this is the type of bamboos that we are talking about. What I was saying, those that I know are these yellow ones, they're yes. small, yes, and Correct. The, I, I'm saying, how can you produce charcoal from that type oh. of uh, it's difficult, yeah? it's difficult. So, seeing is believing, seeing is believing. This is impressive, I'm telling you. 200 hectares? Yes, it's just under 200 hectares, to under be honest. Under 200 hectares? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. We have 50 tons mm -hmm. of this in 20 kg bags. Only Sungui. This is Sungui? Only Sungui. Sungui is. <laughs> hmm? So these are our local stoves. Ooh. So no special stove required? No. Now, what would be the competitive advantage, if I may put it that way, of this type of charcoal from bamboos? Um, Compared to indigenous? Bamboo? Yeah. The main competitive advantage for us is that <clears throat> this has taken us two years of growing mm -hmm. to now be able to produce this. An indigenous tree takes the better part of 50, 80, 60 years, mm -hmm. you know? So, this has just grown for two years and we've, able, we've been able to produce a a charcoal briquette out of this. That is our main advantage. The second is that we 
we have a permanent forest cover. Mm. There's no clear felling. No. So we don't ever destroy our environment. It's, it's always a, a full forest canopy. And um, our process for this is that uh, we plant a seedling and this seedling, like the one that we are standing under, will take about five years. One seedling. This is approximately five years old. So from three years, we can start harvesting firewood. And we can use this same firewood in Chitetes on Baula. Or we can turn this into charcoal and press it into these charcoal briquettes. So this is only two years old. Two, two years. So yes. for us to, to recover, it's just a number of years mm. before we can uh, start making a switch. No, this is impressive. I mean, seeing, believing you have come, you have seen, and uh, you have this uh, makala. I mean, we have an alternative. But we the do. question is, at this point in time, uh, what capacity do you have to supply to all the homes in Malawi? So what we are trying to do is we are currently negotiating with organizations in Europe and in America for this carbon credits. Mm -hmm. They want to be able to find a way to yes. capture carbon credits yes, yes. from a new forest mm -hmm. as well as preserving our old forest. Mm. So the, 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 the generation of those carbon credits will then be used to help subsidize the okay. implementation of this. So we need to establish a tissue culture laboratory here in Malawi, actually on this farm. We, we, we are in negotiations with that at the moment. We're just securing the funding for that. And then we'll be able to produce millions of seedlings at a very affordable price. For me, just say thank you. This is, you know, a model of excellence, let me put it this way. Thank you. As an alternative to the charcoal from the wood, you know, uh, preferably choose to really stop cutting down these trees and go for baboons because when you talk about the sumi sumi it's like a the locals so much of gazika pamoto sanga sanga purusa that's what we know ungozika pamoto sanga sanga purusa you understand the chichiwa i'm sure pangono pangono yeah chambiri jivenecho no no this is this year is it yes this is all this year this is it's about three weeks old three weeks old all the all the new shoots everywhere on the farm are approximately three weeks old three weeks old it's so huge. I wish we had the sugar canes of this type. <laughs> <laughs> no. Thank you very much. We really appreciate it. This is a good, good, good job. And please continue. How much Thank are you. these chitetes uh, on baula? These chitetes on baulas are 2,000 kwacha each. Two we are not the manufacturers. Mm -hmm. My friends next door are the manufacturers of them. And how long does it take to expand? To degrade? Yes. It's approximately two to three years if they take care of oh. the of the stove. Oh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so uh, welcome to Zwan Investments. Um, we are the manufacturer of Chitete Zombaura mm. and also the improved Chago, uh, Chago stove. Mm. This type of the Chago stove uh, is called Ngalaya Moto. Uh, it's a stove that uses less Chago. Ngala, Ngala, it's just the name of uh, the, 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 um, the clay source, uh, the, the place where we collect uh, clay. If you are going to plant uh, Natenje, the other side of the, the light side of Natenje, there's that in Karayapa Gama mm. So that's, oh, the, that's okay. the area where we collect uh, clay, uh, the, the clay that we normally mix the, the, the ceramic part. So we have just uh, uh, named the, 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 the improved charcoal stove called Ngala, Ngala Yamoto. I'd like to welcome you to a special program on Zodiac where we will be talking more about uh, you know, conserving the environment and also you know, some of the um, plants that we can be using uh, for different um, the things that we use in Malawi. So we came to Lisoka. We came to um, Lisoka Estate. Uh, that's close to somewhere in Inchinji uh, where there's a bamboo farm. This farm is 200 hectares 
white. And then bamboo is grown here um, in different bunches. Uh, we went around uh, with the owner of the farm, who is uh, Grant uh, Blamrick. He did quite a number of, he, he, did, he did a lot of an explanation just telling us on how he grows the bamboo. And there, there's, there, there are actually a lot of interesting factors about, uh, uh, you know, what you can do uh, with bamboo when it's fully grown. And uh, we also had the privilege of uh, meeting the minister who actually uh, came here just to appreciate the work that um, uh, Mr. Um, Mr. Grant uh, Blamrick is doing here, growing bamboo. And then, you know, it's a big land. It's 200 hectares. With me is um, Honorable, Honorable Michael Usi, uh, Minister of Natural Resources and Climate Change. Honorable, welcome. Thank you very much. Now you have uh, you have gone round you have gone round and uh, you've seen this bamboo farm. It's uh, two hundred hectares, and I saw you speaking to Grant and uh, quite some interesting uh, facts that he was actually telling you. How do you look at this? This is impressive. Malawi has been grappling with this problem of deforestation. We have uh, understood the people when they cut down trees for charcoal because they need um, a source of energy and that was the only alternative, that's the only option. But now to discover that there is this variety of bamboo which can be harvested within or under four years and produces charcoal which is of a higher quality than that that comes from wood, I would say Malawi has found the option now, an alternative source to energy uh, for energy, you know, so that we can migrate from using charcoal from uh, our trees. Malawi will recover if we strategically uh, plan to invest in bamboo farming so that we can use. And in fact, he has said for a household, only 10 uh, plants of bamboo can actually be sufficient for 82 years. So this is the uh, something that Malawi has been looking for. Now we have found it. So we need to work with this farm to see how we can leverage uh, to, 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 to solve the problems that Malawi is facing as far as uh, forest management and deforestation is concerned. One of the interesting factors that Grant outlined was uh, the period that uh, actually takes for the bamboo to be fully grown uh, and then so that it can be ready uh, to be used to maybe to make uh, different items. Um, we've seen that Malawi has got quite a number of forests that are idle at the moment. You know, um, and with what Grant has actually explained to us about how bamboo is grown, what would you think about the next thing that Malawi, Malawi would do to actually make sure that, um, you know, trees are reserved? Now that we know that bamboo can be fully grown in four to six years and then can be also, we can start using maybe after four years to make different items. What would you think, which direction maybe, I should say, which direction should Malawi uh Take on this well maybe you should allow me to also speak in our vernacular because the people that cut down the trees most of them are in the uh, rural areas uh, and get them to the urban areas for um for sale in a little room vacuum that would be soon we got to bang a macaw the macaw is made to visit the wife because you have a motto my bedroom in the Ndita pita kukata, kuna kutu akukua kuru mene kwa msongo na United Nations, akukambi na nazao sungwi kupanga makawa. Sini mazua kutu kunoko kumawa ikuno, sungwi zimene zozo tirinazo. Ndiye kumene kukwa natu wanesa, kuno tabuira tauna zimene tauna. Andi grant watu uza mene machitia. Voto logwe samitengo kufuna kupanga makawa. And to my own, they say, Sabuti, could it manage to go away, son? Could a Samadule Mitengo? Nangano as a pig and Jan. Come up, what is a Pesega? Wouldn't a good to cool in Sungui, the men is in Gatu Perega Macalao? Ditch for your Rudia Mitengo? Sichi Pesega. Joko has on Gulimbana, what's a rock of Masaway? If was the Ringati, wouldn't a goody Seu Musadu says the Lusani Seu, win a Maca Camina Seu. We now, do Matiai. Se wote mudu se boma lakupa sali duu ndeno makuwa plana nde apa pata saji te kunyengeli na nai yai ngani yote ngamakala kudula mitengo zizikanga dumutu amangira chamba pa 
pa, pa, pa njinga ndio wagidwa nacho ndio ni ngozi kifua makala alipo ocho kuna kusungwi msana fike kuno ni makai ikabe kuti kuma kweni kweni zima uneka bwanji ndiye kukuyanga ni fusulani amalawi tichikonde dziko latu mavuto tukwaona wa anthu kupedwa ndi madzi ndifachona kuti mitengo yadulidwa mapiri kumaso malawi ita kukala chipalamba kapela desert kuma lero tine kuti mulungu atikonda kuna kuti mavuto watukumana nao tukuona sutu kuti sungwi and iwo simu mtu wote akukaka mira kuti ndikaina zondeka akuti yai midzimu mzinyumbamu tikale ndi mitengo imene yiye ndiye paka ndondomeko yoka mira ndi maiko olemera kuti titandizane makalao azikao chipa komaso mitengo imene yiye ya sungwi izalidwe pose pose kuti anthu azigwirisa nchito ngati nkhuni ndiye palibe so njira ziwiri ya njira je ndi imodzi nkhuni Zizi chokera kusungwi za special zimene kunokota ziwona ndiposo ino amene mukujambulanu zijambuleni anthu aziwone kifua ina kumasusa kuti sungwi ineso ndi makai kati machokera kumula nje sungwi za kwathu sunga phikire iyi kumalilo ndaona kuti ndizo siyana chabwe ino ndemwe na paliso mabungu ena amene auma amalimbikitsa anthu kuti azidzala nsungwi koma sungwi zake ndi zimene mwanena kuti tikaziponya pa moto ndi pulusa lokaloka iyi ikoneka kuti insungwi za ntundu wina mwina akungu alimbikitsa amene amali maso zinazo kuti nsungwi za bwinozi zimene zilipo zoti amala okhoza kumagwitsa nchito zilipo ndikole nsungwi zi zilipo komaso chokomera chake nchono kuti nsungwi zi zikukula ndi manyowa manyowa akumudzopewa nsungwi zi zikukula komaso mucha kumapeza ndalama Kusoglo kutirongosola kuti nakuti kungozala nsungwi ngati zimene zizi atha kumala ndira ndalama kuchokera ku maiko azungu chifwa maiko azungu akonda dzikula pasi kupyorera ma company yao kapena ndina kuti ma factory yao akumati kusa usi uchochura carbon dioxide amene akupangisa kuti uh, chirengedwe chisinthe ovutika ku makala anthu osauka kuno kwa Africa ndiye pali gwirizana ona kuti kuno kuti zizala mitengo tizala nsungwi kuti nsungwi zo ndi mitengo iziyamwa carbon dioxide sikuti sikaza kulere kuna tikuna nasopa nokuna kuti aliense amena akubwera kuti apange invest kapena kuika ndrama zache munkhani zo bweze tsachirengedwe pozala mitengo nsungwi tozo kuti amalawi apindulepo kusakala ngati ngodi wa anthu olemera iyi ndiye pakali pano nine mosabisa kuti ndiro kondwa kuti nsungwi zimene ni maikaikira zo ndaziona akamati nsungwi ya a uh, mirungu itatu nita kuone sana itu ine usungu ya mbwele muone to say jitu ichi 3 weeks sungu ii 3 weeks sungu ii 3 weeks mkona mm. kumaso akadula zimena kudula zi ndumaka pikira zina zoka zugamba kumera kusuza unakuti ngalango ii si munga fiko di pakali jipala amba ukadula Ina ya pshantima pasipo udani, yukumera. Udure ina, ina ya pshantima, yukumera. Sizo tia, tadula sungi za tapo, aa, zikumamera. Ndiye paka lipanopo, paka la kampeni, zala nisungwi. Zo uti zikupase ni ndalama, musadule so mitengo. Muka dula mitengo kusogoloku, sungwi ziri mbwe. Mwanya mula chamba, panjinga, ndipo ngondo mui wona. Chabu na nduna tatogoza kwa mbili. Amene yonditu ndi nduna uh, um, ole mekezeka uh, maigo usi kutilongo solera za mbili. Za nditu uh, mitengu yemene insungu zimene zimene tinabwela kuno kulisoka. Uh, nditu estate kuzaona kutigodi uh, mkula mene ya mene akuzala insungu zimene zi. Ama zala modani. Komaso akumazi samalira modani. Nde anatuza abonu za mbili kuti iyeyo kumalai kuno anabwela karikari. Nditu wakalako zaka zoku ana twente. Grant uh, Bloomberg ndo wagu South Africa Komano anajita jidwi Ndu kumalai kuno kuda Kuli ntaka ya bwino Komanso nditu Ndiko za kulima nsungu Nga tizimezi Malo wanda kuru Ndi 200 hectares uh, tima, tima mufu So tukodi nsungu Nsungu imodzi Kuti ipeze kodi ya kula Ya amba, amba, amba ukweza nchito Nisi matenga Nitawe ya itali banji Ndana ruzo Ndi ya Nisi matenga Ndana ruzo Ndi ya Nisi matenga Ndana ruzo Ndi ya Nisi matenga Ndana ruzo Ndi ya Nisi mat
ima kala kuti nsungwija ili pa mwamba nditu ya gula komaso ili malo kuti um, ya kwima ii koza wamba kukwisi do nchitu komaso mena nene na nduna kuti ubuino wa geso ndo kuti muka dula nsungwija ima mena iyo kantawi yomwe ima amba kumame ilapa sibaja ndia paka dalipa anu ndufuna ndi tiankule ndi grant bloomrick amene ndi munu wage wa estate imene hii kuti timve zambiri kutuko di nkula mene aka wakala kuchita modern ndie tina kamba so uh, poyamba pacha kuti nsungu zimenezi zima teka ugwitsi na nchito zinduzo siyana siyana uh, maga maga grant ya matuza kuti pali zambiri zimene munga gwitsi na nchito zinduzo posa 100 zimene munga teku banga kuchoka kusungu ndie tinda nza atu adziwa an investment amene wama banga mbaula zimenezi kwa mbaula zimenezi munga tumone mene anazipangira design ababa mene watipa lowe nkuni haba kuti moro zibu ilabu nubuino ndie mbaula zimenezi uh, njitu ni mbaula zogudi munga kani nsungu Uh, matandi tu kudula dula bunu bwino ti mapisi ndi kuika kumeneku ati ndi ngokuonetsa ni chomwe ndotanda uza tione kuti kodi zima lowa motani ndi kuti pamene pa mukhozopeza kuti mwaika ndi tunkhuni zanu ngusungwi zimenezi zouma bunu bwino ndi kumaphikira uh, zinthu kumapya bunu bwino komanso kunsungwi komweko amathaso kupanga ti mati makhala kuchokera kunsungwi ndi pompano ndi tu adzi one investment na also anaribuletsera kuti tuone kuti kodi makala amene wa magwira nchiro banje mene mukonera mene pakuyakira pa mbaula apa ndi makala okuti makala nthaye tali ko basi chibisi ndi chichikupya apa chiti kamaliza kuya nkhola tichi rawa so kuti kodi chapya modani ndiye nsungwizi ndi tu nchito yake yogwirisira ndi zambiri uh, ndi ita na modzi wa ku dziwan uh, investment kuti ndi ngo yankhola nawo bwana angoti usa zipiri zitaro zokhuzana ndi kuti mbaula zimena mapangazi komanso makala amene wa zimaenda bwanje ndi Kuni zimenezi zima yaka bwino takugulitsapo mwira 23 um, kwa ngona kwa chisapo kuti ni makastoma za mini no uh, zikathela nsungu zimenezi amadimbira phone kunaya kuti tibafuna kuti bweretsere nkuni zi cha kuti tiphikire mu chitetezo mbaula so ndi business ya bwino kwaifeyo komaso ndi timagulitsa pa ntengo ndi thonera kuti omvelerera kuti be anthu akutogwanitsa mudzi wa ino nena kuti masiku ano nkuni zikudula kwambiri zikusowa wa zikudula koma nsungu izi zima yaka ndi thuwambiri ndi nsungu zono kuti zikamayaka ndi thuchi na chose mini afuna pige uh, zima tega um, kupatu wankani ya jitete zomba ula ifeso adzi wa investments tima banga mba ula imene ya makala imene tima icha kuti uh, ngala ya moto ngala ya moto ndi mba ula imene tinaipa nga toka uh, mu 2019 ndi mba ula imene kuti um, uh, ima kukulisa nchito makala kuma ojeba kusiana kwa mba ula imene ndi mba ula zina zija zimina mango koma antu misika ndi kwa nina kuti mba ula izi zima kukulisa nchito makala ojeba kuma aso ndi zorimba muko za kuona ndi tuna kuti a uh, hii ndi tebulo koma tikupika pa tebulo ndeti kamaka mpa zankhani ya smart kapena green ndi kuti a uh, household ikungenera kuti ikhale ndi mbola imene kuna kuti akhozophikira ka pasi pali mathai rose pa khonde ka pa carpet mbola imene imapika ndi tuopanda songo zina ili yose ndi mbola yolimba koma somba ole imene magwisa nchito makala ochepa a uh, tina vanga save imene no anatithandizira za twa modern cooking for healthy forest ndi thandizo kira ku use ndi komaso ke ed zinapeza zono kuti a ma household amene akwisa nchito mbola izizi ama seva ndrama zokwana 1700 per week as to compare ni ma households kapena ma families amena ma pigira a a a mbaula zongo gulapo zimene zimangopezeka ma 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 community zo zo ngwambiri chabwino ndi maka maka kapangidwe ka makalawa zima kuti ngani nthawe yatali bwanje kuti mupange makalawa atuluke kuti mutha akhozo akhozo magwitsa nchiro a uh, kapangidwe ka makala sindi nga photo wose bwino bwino uh, tsarane sarane amene amapangira chifukwa ndi partnership ya dziwan investments in Africa mukabena grant so ali ndi mbali ina amene no ali ndi production yao amene amapangira makala wa koma ndi makala onena kuti amataka ati pange fair supply timapanga so packaging ma 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 
a uh, size kavena kuti mu ma packet yangona ngono one na kuti anthu akwanitse kugula moninga na ndi nthumba mwao ndipo ndi makalo ndi na kuti ndi awati kupikira chips apa tapika chips yoyamba chapcha um abaso ndi kupika chips ya chiwiri olonyemba ndi zone kuti kupira omepa ndi zotheka komano um production capacity ya Mr Grant ndi ekuru kwambiri fanda ona akupititsa ku Central Portre amapanga ma chicken brooders kuti ma azika mu jeni ma ma makola ankhuku kuti mwana anapi aja muzitenta akupititsa maka siya kumene kujako ndepo no banga ndona kuti dzwani investments ndi Africa mukapena ndi Mr Grant yo kipangane kuti aziti patsa makala amene wa ifeo tizitha kwa gulitsa ma community zimene feo ti magulitsa ndi kama gulitsa mbaula tizi gulitsa so makala wa cholinga chonya kuti anthu atebe kutha kufikira kugulitsa ntchito makala komo sadi makala ake aja ochokira kunzara nyama koma makala ochita kupangidwa ma chago briquets ochokira ku ku Africa chabu ino nditu amene ndi mmodzi mwa kula kulu ku dziwan investment amapanga mbaula komanso nditu ndi zina zotero zimene ari furukuzera nkhani eni eni yosangalatsa ndi kuti mbaula si zimatenga makala ochepa makala wa opangidwa kuchokera ku nsongwe osati bug kugula tsiku limozi one week yata yeah zimene alo kusola apa ndizimene ndi kuona ngati ngati malawi ngati dziko kuti dipitirire kusunga chilengedo chathu bwino bwino nsungu izi muli mayankho ochuluka kwa basi ndipo mpano ndikhali wa ndi grant amene ndi thali muno wake wa um for state mene kunaiso atuze za mbiri zokhuza mene maka maka amapangira makala amene kuti mve kuti kodama panga bwanje komanso kuti ino mukafuna angapezeke kuti ndipo kuti amakhala nthawi ya itali modern Madame Kasambala. But it's five hundred. Five thousand five hundred. Oh. What is the number? Number. Number. I'm going to get the chips. I'm going to get the chips. We're going to get the grant. We're going to get our chips. Chipisi, to pick up a macara, a sungi. So when we go to the bank, we don't pass it. We pass it over to the bank. Só no business ninguém ainda junto. Tudo que mandar eu falei não vou pagar. Tu vai andar mais a bilhete. Tudo usando. Tinha de não gostar de música. Não quero morrer de jambi. Não quero pular assim, né? <laughs> All right, so uh, like I said, we are still here at Lisoke Estate where we've been going around just to appreciate how much bamboo is uh, grown around here and, uh, and also what can be used as a country, how can we benefit from um, uh, bamboo. So like I said that I'll be talking to Grant, he's right here with me, welcome Grant. Thank you, thank you very much. This is so interesting, we've seen quite an amazing uh, you know, uh, 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 200 hectares farm where you grow bamboo and uh, you know earlier on when we were chatting you were you know telling us on quite a number of things that can be produced from uh, bamboo alone but firstly i want to know how do you how how do you get these seeds in the country so these seedlings are imported from indonesia okay they come from tissue culture and what tissue culture is is um, a fancy word for cloning right so it's done in an environment in a laboratory that is conducive to growth 
okay so every four weeks they're able to take one seedling and basically produce two and then four weeks later two into four four into eight so on and so forth so this is the only way we believe that um, this giant tropical bamboo can be propagated because uh, it only produces seed every hundred odd years and that is not a viable option we can't afford to wait a hundred years for these seedlings to produce seed and then propagate from there so the only known method worldwide is tissue culture so this is where our seedlings come from for every seedling that you see behind me has been in an aeroplane yeah. all right now uh, maybe the, the big question uh, would be how long does it take uh, for the bamboo to fully grow and then so that they can they can be fully ma uh, fully matured uh, to be used okay. you know in different ways all right so depending on your environment your your soil type your rainfall it can range from five to seven years to fully mature but in most cases we believe that you can start harvesting bamboo from three to four years onwards for firewood and poles and different items like that um, you know, there's, there's, there's more than a thousand uses of bamboo registered um, in different products. So we have a, a huge range of products that can be developed from this bamboo. Now, uh, we, we, we also know that in Malawi, uh, we have a problem where, you know, uh, there is one doing cutting down of trees, uh, which is, you know, it's devastating. And, uh, you know, the environment is being, um, uh, is being um, uh, messed because of that. Yes. When you were explaining about how you grow bamboo and then, you know, the whole process, what advice can you have for the Malawian farmers or for Malawi in general? Mm -hmm. So, I mean, growing bamboo is, is basically like growing any other tree, really. Um, do good land preparation. So for us, when we sell our seedlings, we recommend a one meter by one meter by one meter planting hole and uh, to use compost or old uh, mature manure that is available from goats, chickens, cows and keep the goats away from the bamboo for the first year planted at the beginning of the rainy season and you should be absolutely fine there's there's nothing different about growing bamboo to to any other tree only that it can you can start harvesting it from three years and uh, you can harvest it for the next hundred years now we know that before you start getting into something uh, the, the, the the fear for most of the people is i mean how am i going to do this mm -hmm. what do you need for you to grow bamboo so first of all, you need uh, some, some good quality land that uh, you're prepared to, to plant a seedling on and uh, buy a seedling. I mean, we offer, we offer training to, to those who buy large quantities of seedlings that um, would like to, to replicate the plantation that we have. And we, we cover that in training. So it's a workshop. It's, it's, it's something that you can learn in, in half a day on how to look after your bamboo and how to plant it. How long has, it, has this farm existed? This farm has existed since 2015. This particular plantation that we're standing in is approximately five years old. All right. I mean, in the grant, I mean, in the Munoage, wa in the bamboo farm, I mean, I mean, we soka. I did all this soka. I mean, we chop and change. We go into, I mean, we farm. I mean, we munga te. We go into good in sungui. Zima guiri tidoan chiro zosiana siana. The munga walongo solera guiri in sungui. The injere mo zime ne tinga guiri sen chiro ngada malawi. Kuma guiri sen chiro ngadi kubanga magala. Kuma sogone te saudi chiri ngedwe. Chiu sungi da bonobu no jifuga mirengo igumadu di dogombiri. Kuma musungi mo mo. Zambi zimeti mabanga tika magu hitsa nchiro mirengo zima taso kutega monsungi mwemu.